Hello friends. Today we do a topic of mean division from mean and mean division from median. It's a topic in class 11th mathematics. I think the chapter name is how to find mean division from mean median how to find uh, standard deviation and um, there are a few word problems related to mean deviation and standard deviation okay so guys uh, first you know how to find mean this x bar is a symbol of finding mean and this is m e for symbol for finding median in the previous videos i told you how to find mean in all series but the one method I use is direct method and in the second video that is also the previous videos I told you how to find median in all series. So today we find the mean deviation for um, about mean and median. Just have a look on the things of mean deviation. The formula is same whether you use from mean or median mean division for individual series and we have discrete series and we have continuous series so this is sigma mod d upon small n where small n is number of observation this is sigma f mod d by capital n where capital n is um, the small n is number of observation observation and capital n is sigma f i same formula is sigma f mod d upon capital N. These two formulas are same. Now how to find mod d? Mod d is xi minus either mean if you are doing for mean or xi minus median. So you know how to find mean and you know how to find median. So let's um, go to the examples. But before going to the examples, I just tell you how to find the coefficient of mean deviation that is mean deviation the form answer of mean deviation upon either mean or the answer of mean deviation upon the answer of median okay guys so let's have a look on that this part first we do the topic mean division from mean and we are doing the individual series okay guys so we have xi we have xi as 4 7 8 9 10 12 13 17 so we have to do a total of so we have total as 80 and n as 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 so we have n as 8 now we have to find the mean so mean is sigma xi upon n that is 80 upon 8 that is what 10 so now we have to find the mod d how to find the mod d xi minus mean and your mean is what 10 so we we can write down 10 xi minus 10 you have to subtract um, 10 from these observation to find the absolute capital D. So 10 minus 10 is 0 and 9 minus 10 is minus 1, 8 minus 10 is 2, 7 minus 10 is 3, 4 minus 10 is 6. So 12 minus 10 is 2, 30 minus 10 is 3, 30, 17 minus 10 is 7. So you have to sigma mod D. So you have to add them. Your answer is 24. 
So how to find mean division? Mean division is sigma mod d because we are doing individual series. There is no frequency, only the raw data. So the answer is sigma mod d upon small n. That is uh, your 24 by 8. So your answer is what? 3. Now you have to find the coefficient of um, md that is uh, md upon mean because we are doing, doing a topic from the mean. We are finding the mean division from mean. So mean division answer is 3. Answer is your mean is 10. So the answer is 0.3. So guys we have done uh, the mean division from mean individual series. Now we go to mean division from mean x bar discrete series so guys in this we have xi we have fi so first you have 5 10 15 20 and 25 then you have fi 7 4 6 3 and 5 got it so let's check this is fi xi is 35 40 90 60 and 125 so your total is of fi is 25 and your total of uh, this is um, 350. This is your capital N. So we are finding the mean. How to find mean? Mean is a discrete series sigma fi xi upon capital N. That is 350 upon 25. So your answer is um, 570. And your answer is 14. Now you have to find the capital D. How to find capital D? That is xi, xi minus mean and here mean is 14. The mean is 14. So you have to subtract 14 from these observations. Let's start from 15. 15 minus 14 is 1 mod D. 10 minus 14 is minus 4. 4 mod absolute value. Absolute value of any number is always positive mod of x is equal to mod of minus x. So this is... 9, 6, 11. Formula of finding mean division is uh, sigma f mod d by capital N. So this is your, uh, we have to find f mod d. So f mod d is 7 into this. So 63, 16, 6, 18 and 55. You have to add them. And you can add. So answer is 158 upon 25. So now uh, you can cut them. So by 5 and then 5. Your answer is 6.32. Okay. So now the coefficient of MD is MD upon your answer is mean. So that is 6.32 divided by 14. So that is 632 upon 14. So you can cut by 2. Your answer is 3.16. Then you can cut from 0.4. That is 3. Then 5. That is 1. 0.451 is your coefficient of MD. Okay guys, now the next part is how to find mean division from mean continuous series. Continuous series is your last topic of finding mean division from mean. Okay guys, so let's check how you do. You have a question of uh, we are doing from mean, so we are finding mean division from mean answer continuous series continuous series we have a question zero hundred there is a gap of 
100 till we have to write down let's see and you have frequency also you have frequency as uh, 4 8 9 10 7 5 4 3 so you have to do this question you have to find mean deviation from mean guys have a look this is your 50 you have to find first mean because we are finding the mean with the help of sigma fi xi upon sigma fi this is a direct method which i showed you in the previous videos also so xi is your class mark upper limit plus lower limit divided by 2 you have class size of 100 so guys just have a quick look okay so now we have to find fi xi this is your 200, 1200, 2250, 3500, 3150, 2750, 2600, 2250. You have to add them. Okay, so your answer is 17,000. 900 upon 50 that is uh, if you multiply by 2 on the upside so you have um, 0 18 5 3 upon 10 the answer is 358 you use just uh, Vedic mass so 358 years is your mean now you have to find mod D and after that you have to find F mod D so you have to subtract 358 from xi you know the formula of mod d is xi minus mean so you have to subtract 358 from here the answer is modulus so this is your 8 and then there's a difference of 100 108 then again 100 208 and then again 100 308 okay this is just a trick see again 350 minus 358 is 8 then there is a difference of 100 it is increase increase and increase now 450 450 minus uh, 358 is 92 then there is a gain of 100 this is 192 292 and 392 guys there is a tough calculation here so now we have to find f mod d i just use a different color to show how you can find mod d without any um, hassle so now f mod d you multiply 4 with this, 8 with this, this 8 into 10 is 80, like this. Okay guys, this is 32, then this is 12, this 8 is 64, then 16, 9 into 108 is 972, same 7 into this is 14, 1644, 4. like this, 960. 1168 1176 your total is 6 9 8 7 guys kindly check the total also yeah mean division is sometimes there is a mistake also sigma f mod d upon capital n your 7896 upon your 50 you multiply by 2 and divided by 100 that is 15792 if you multiply by 2 this we use Vedic maths 157.92 is your mean division now you have to find the coefficient of mean division this answer is uh, absolute measure and this answer is your relative measure so answer is mean division upon mean so your answer is 157.92 upon 358 
this is a little tough for all students you have to multiply so you answer is 15792 divided by 35800 so your answer is um, zero point because you have to do it in a calculation manner so answer is 0. 0.441 so guys, we have done mean division in individual series. We have done mean division in uh, uh, discrete series and we have done mean division in continuous series also. So after that, we do how to find mean division in from median in all the series. So here we will take a break.